today is day four of week two and it's one of those days where it's just insanely hot outside and way past my 21 degree threshold I think we're at 29 maybe right now 28 30 degrees if we take the humidity into account maybe we're hitting like 35 I don't even know some crazy stuff so yeah um, I've been taking it up a notch been practicing my jump serves That's very useful. Very, very useful for my skating. Why not? Let's practice jump serves. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so obviously I'm not doing the best job at it right now. I think the hardest part is getting that toss. It's actually harder than you think. I was watching Haikyuu and they were just nailing them. Slamming it across the court like nothing. I don't know any technique or anything, I'm just sort of imitating the best that I can, but that toss is just not good. What? See, it seems that I need to time how high I throw it, also how far I throw it, and then I have to time how I jump to it. It's a lot of stuff. Volleyball's hard. I look like a nerd out here. What? So the jump serve is improving. It's become my new warm up. Still feel a little stiff from yesterday, but it's okay. Indoors is good. Indoors is good. Yes, back to my natural habitat. Oh, this temperature's so much better. Oh, that's cool. That's good. That's really good. Yes, yeah, definitely much better. Temperature, way, way better for me at least. It's not too cold. The ice is nice and soft because of it. It's been flooded recently for the past 20 minutes, but it's still a little bit wet. I don't know if you can tell, but basically that means that the ice is gonna be good, in my opinion. <laughs> He's just giving me weird looks just because I'm skating around with a humongous camera in my hand, but it's worth it. It's worth it for all you 7,000 wonderful people, which apparently we hit 7,000 subscribers today or yesterday. It's pretty crazy. It's pretty cool. I'm waiting for the day that my subs surpass my Instagram followers. That'd be like an honor. An actual honor. Oh, counting down when I hit 10k subs. That'll be a huge milestone. 10,000 subs on YouTube is pretty cool. Hashtag YouTube life. I woke up a little more sore than usual this morning. My right hip flexor is a little tight. Uh, it's very normal for me. The whole idea is just to maintain it and make sure I don't make it worse. I've had times, and this is like so, so common for me, I usually just call it like tweaking. So if I tweak my hip, it's like you pull it to the point where it's just too much and it gets so bad that I can't even like lift my leg. Like lift my leg like this, that is. So that's like worst case scenario, but even then that's like a very, very mild, mild injury. And I can get over it within two or three days, but I don't want to let it get to that point. So it's just a little bit tight today. Probably won't do quad sal today. Don't leave that for Friday, like I said earlier. I don't know about triple axle because that's more force on my hip. So we might just stick to some triples today. Maybe we'll do some spins. Today might be a spinning day. When you don't spin for a while, oh, the dizziness is real. I'm, uh, I'm gonna get going. I've been skating around with this camera for a solid three minutes, which probably cost me, I don't know, $5. So I should probably start skating now. Okay, so I gotta say, even after the skate sharpening, even after skiing for almost two weeks, I still have these moments when I'm doing stroking. I'm so used to pushing my edge really, really deep and relying on it. But right now, like sometimes, sometimes it's still too much for me to handle. So I push the edge a little too far and I can feel myself go a little. So 
we're still not 100% confident with the edges. I still feel like I'm gliding on top of the ice instead of gliding in the ice. So there's a slight disconnect. Like I'm going on top of it, I'm not in it. I'm not part of it. It's still there, right? Like the past few days I thought I was like 100% back, but now that I'm doing more stuff here and there, I'm definitely feeling I'm still not 100% like grounded, if that makes any sense. So it took some time, but the first few triple styles that I was doing was not feeling quad-like. Then after doing a ton of them, now they feel way more quad-like. We'll see at the end of the session how I feel, but if I don't do them today, at least I have that foundation set for tomorrow, but we'll see. Okay, so I've decided for today's training session, we're gonna leave this quad style. That's the more responsible decision. Like I said last night, it's not a rush. You know, I really, really wanna do it, but I've decided to compromise. We're gonna do one triple axel. However it is, whether it's good or bad, I'm gonna just try one, do one, and then move on with my life and do some spins. Okay, so it wasn't perfect, but uh, I mean, it's not bad. For, for Thursday, Thursday training. Not, not, not great, not terrible. Accomplished, somewhat. All right, now for some spins. I'm gonna run each spin once and see how I hold up. If you don't spin for two and a half months, it becomes a, 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 nauseous. <laughs> That's the best word I can explain. Nauseating. So it's nauseating. Um, I do feel my center is really bad right now. Positions are fine because I was stretching the whole time when I wasn't skating, so it's not like I'm less flexible now, but I just haven't been spinning, so feeling the center and spinning around a center doesn't exist, and my ability to become undizzy quickly doesn't exist either. I'm getting a headache almost. Okay, let's go, another one. So, the center on that was better. I feel like my eyes are now coming out of my eye sockets. I'm gonna try to spin the hell out of this one. Like, I'm gonna try to spin it like crazy. The only thing is, I might not finish it because I might fall in the middle of it, but I'm gonna try to spin it like absolutely bonkers. Last spin, I'm gonna do my combo spin, and I'm calling it for the day. Still have a long day tomorrow to finish off the week, so. Let's just do this spin. Okay, so that's it. I'm calling it. <sighs> One side effect sometimes I actually burst blood vessels on my face. So I'll get like red dots everywhere. Almost looks like like red freckles. Alright, that's it for Thursday, day, day four, week two, last day tomorrow. Let's see if we get a quad in. Honestly, even if I don't next week, I'll do it on week week three. It doesn't really matter at this point. Alright, let's go. <laughs> 